Shannon Cox is here, and I have never met Shannon before in my entire life, and he's here to be introduced <laughs> and to everyone uh, in our viewing audience. Shannon, thanks so much Thank for you. taking time out to come on a, probably a busy day for you. Thanks for having me. Yeah. Um, actually, the weather's been kind of crazy, so it's kind of put me a little bit behind right now. Well, explain well, what yeah. your business is. Well, okay, I do pressure washing and window cleaning services okay. for uh, anything from businesses to homes, um, schools, whatever there might be, I'll do it. Okay, so when you say window wow, washing, yeah. is that with your pressure washer or do you go in like the, uh, the old squeegee type? Uh, yeah, that yeah, kind of thing. Yeah. Well, I've actually got a couple methods. One of them I'm really excited about. Okay. I bought a very unique piece of equipment to clean exterior windows with, with a water-fed pole. Okay. Um, which helps me stay a lot more efficient mm -hmm. and safer for myself mm -hmm. and my yeah. employees instead of having to move ladders around on your property okay. and right. things yeah. like that. So it's an extension pole that the, the water goes up to the, yes, sir. the device and, and then, then you clean it that pressure. way. Yes, sir. And, and it, has, it has a brush on the end of it, so I take that brush. Is that what we're talking about right there in the middle of the screen? Or yes, absolutely. Yes. Okay. That's my zero, zero pure machine there, and I'm very proud of that machine. It's, it does an amazing job, okay. and it keeps me safe and more efficient. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. And it actually, um, it's got a deionizing tank on it, so when that water goes through a reverse osmosis system and then through that oh. deionizing okay. tank, when that water comes out, it's 100% pure. Like, there is no chemicals, Why no particles. Why is that important? <clears throat> well, because then that way we don't have to climb up there and squeegee because when it dries on the water, it dries on the windows, it leaves no... Oh, there's no oh. residue in the water. Right. Exactly. Oh, so that where That's water it. spots come from? Exactly. So there's zero water spots on the windows. When we're done, we move on and we just go to the next window. And as it dries, it, it actually helps to repel dirt. It's perfectly wow. clear, okay. clear. Clear, yes. Oh, it's amazing. Wow. It for really us is. On, wow. For us people on dirt roads. <laughs> yeah, really. I'm thinking, really. Wow. And, the, and, you know, as we've, as, we, as we've used this pole, people are just amazed at how clean yeah. the windows come. Wow, They're just okay. like, wow. And, you know, because and it doesn't does it leave last, any streaks it, or anything. Does it last longer? Yeah, it seems it like does there. last longer. Yes, it does. Okay. Because There's the nothing to grab a hold of. Right. And that, kind of one of the terms of the, the water that we actually rinse the window. So we actually brush the window and the frames. And then we hold the pole off of the window just about six or eight inches, and we spray the whole window down with the clean water. Mm -hmm. And it actually just pulls that dirt right off the <laughs> windows and frames and makes them look amazing. Okay. Um, and I also do interior uh, window cleaning. I will do high dusting, ceiling fans, chandeliers, um, walls. Is uh, that by hand, too? How is yes, that Yes, sir. Now, I've got extension poles to do the interior things. Mm -hmm. I wear booty covers for my okay. customers, and my employees will wear booty covers, so we're not tracking dirt and things sure. inside right. your house. Yeah. Um, we have one of those areas that, I mean, my husband got the big ladder up, you know, I was like, you may as well change the light bulbs and everything else while you're sure, there. Yeah. Some, and we, so we'll do that, too. We'll do light bulbs and high dusting and things, so it's that time of year. Spring's coming. A lot of people want to do spring yeah. cleaning and things yeah, like right, that. Right, right. Um, so, so that's what I'm into, and awesome. I really enjoy okay. it. Now, the pressure washing, that's, ent that's an entirely different aspect Absolutely. of your business, yes, but it's sir. something you do also. Yes, sir. Kind of explain what, what? what kind of jobs do you do. Yeah. Well, we do basically, and this sounds maybe crazy, but we'll do anything that's not moving down the road. You know, I can clean anything. Anything that's not moving down the road, I can clean it, and it feels great. I love to show up, and, and your, your vinyl siding or your vinyl uh -huh. fence or your deck or whatever mm -hmm. looks mm -hmm molded and black mold and dirt whatever yeah. and when i leave it's, it looks brand new you okay. know and it makes yeah. me very happy so that's an enjoyment i get immediately and to see my customers uh proud of their property again and keeping you know it maintains your property if you leave things on your 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 vinyl siding and whatnot over time it may deteriorate right. deteriorate now, that product what are we looking at here is that oh. that's up? that's oh. magnus toyota uh -huh. and um you clean the storefront there i got to clean the windows there and i was okay. very proud that the the magnus team let me do their windows and uh it was very fun okay yeah All were right. they impressed though you know i think so i haven't heard any <laughs> complaints from anybody i haven't heard any complaints what is uh, that? this is jerry jackson's realty office oh okay and um, I pressure washed that thing, and it really needed it. And I was very proud. You can see. You can see what, yeah. You can see oh the difference gosh, there. Oh my gosh, Jerry! How did you let that thing get so bad? It was actually Jeff that <laughs> took the Jeff. Jeff Pratt gave me the opportunity to work oh, for him funny. there, and uh, he liked my work, and he's got me working on a house for him as well. Well, so. good, good deal. That's how we'll you, do pools and yeah. patio furniture oh, and decks okay. and uh, even like you said, anything anything that's, that's not, not moving. moving. You know, I, I did a tur I did three turkey houses. I see week one before right there. last. Yes, is that before oh, or after? Wow. Well, that's you can see on the left hand side. That's the clean screens in the in the. Uh huh. Oh, know, I see. The that. left side of the barn's clean, and the right yeah. side's still dirty. Well, on the left, it's so I it's, took a I took a left side and the right side, so I had clean, and that's a four hundred foot house. 
Well, it took me 10 not, hours straight to clean that, the whole thing. That's Dang. not very uh, close, if you, not unless you have a, a big t screen TV. But right. the left side was kind of had a blue cl clear tint, and the other right. had, a, had, a, had a yellow, ugly uh, tint. Exactly. So that's yes, the sir. difference. Okay. So if someone's interested in doing that, you will provide estimates, obviously, to so they're prepared. Yes, ma'am, absolutely. <laughs> Free estimates all the time. And, um, you know, I always tell my customers, you know, you can go with whoever you want. You know, there's people that will do things cheaper. Yeah, right. But if they don't have the proper equipment to do the jobs, they, they might damage your property. You know, uh, you just get some guy that just went to Home Depot and bought a little rig and goes out and doesn't have the proper things, could possibly potentially damage your, your property. Um, I know if, you, if, you're, if the pressure is too high, you'll damage your deck. Absolutely. And I don't actually use high pressure to wash certain applications, especially on like vinyl side right. and over right. wood yeah, frames and things like that. Mm -hmm. You need to be very conscientious about what you're doing uh -huh. when you're doing those jobs because I don't want to have to come back and fix your vinyl siding. So um, you can tell by looking at a, a surface and a job on, on what specific types of cleaning method that you'll use. Absolutely. Yeah. Um, and you know, like there's some, there's some even businesses around that have older concrete. And instead of hitting that with a high pressure, I will use a low low pressure mm -hmm. system to wash that and mm -hmm. even if it takes me a little longer I'd rather take a little longer than yeah. damage your property mm -hmm. you know right. so I want to leave it I want to leave you you know with the, with the best possible outcome okay. and um, so you have to pay attention to stress fractures on concrete and looking at boards and going around and like sometimes even on vinyl sidings on homes you know you might have like where the lawnmower threw a rock and oh, yeah. and damaged a little hole or something and you I need to those. you need to be very careful of mm -hmm. those things and mm -hmm. work around it and you know, maybe do a little hand scrubbing on that part to get it mm -hmm. instead of sure, hitting it with sure. even a yeah. low pressure. So um, just being very careful with people's things is important to me. Well, we've got your information up on the screen there, and that's your uh, direct phone number. Do you have a Facebook page or a, a I, website or anything? I that? am working on that. I well, you're, pro you're probably a, a hands-on, work-everyday kind of guy, yes, so sir. you don't do social media and all well, that I much. Well, I do have my own Facebook page and uh, just for my name yeah. and... Uh, and I've been just throwing stuff out there, so I'm sure. going to transfer that over. But well, you can search for Shannon Cox yes, on sir. Facebook and, yes, sir. and, and say, hey, buddy, come on by. We'll do, yes, do a free estimate for me. Um, we do carry a million-dollar insurance policy, too, for business owners and okay. homeowners to be aware um, that, you know, we've got you covered even if we did make a mistake or something bad was yeah, to okay. happen. We've yeah. got you covered. Okay. All right. Well, thanks for coming Thank by. Thank you, you so much. much. Uh, I appreciate it. Good luck to you and your business, and hope, you. hopefully it grows. And, Thank you. And it sounds like uh, you've got the proper business for the proper application that's needed. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you for being here. Appreciate it. All right. Thanks so much. Thank you. Yeah. We are going to take a break, and we're going to introduce uh, you to Mark Rackley. Here's, he's here to talk about an event. Is that correct? The North American Collaboration Summit. And that's we'll, all yeah. I can say about it. We'll find out he's all about that. Say it. Stay with us. Yeah. 